1973 is all I got to say. They need a top 10 player to come to that team for them to become something. And I don't see a top 10 player wanting to come to New York or coming available to even for New York to even approach them. I still see the Knicks as still the Knicks. You can tell me they're building stability and whatever like that. All right, that's cool. How is their stability when their head coach is on the hot seat? How is their stability when I just told you that your future is still the second round and getting bounced? Is that success in New York? No. Justin, you just got finished saying a couple of minutes ago, the New York teams have sucked. You're right. I said New York teams suck. So we want to see our team get to the damn playoffs consistently. All right? That's first and foremost. Let's get to the damn playoffs and let's see if we can get the thing done. If we can't, then we evaluate. Some star will eventually come available or we'll develop one. We're developing a really good team. And John highlighted some of the great picks that we've had, whether it be second round picks or not. We're building some pieces. I'm not saying any of these guys are going to become superstars. You say just get to the playoffs, but my guy, these guys are going to start getting older. Jalen Brunson's 26. What is this, a four or five year plan, six year plan? You say, let's just get to the playoffs. So when do you want to see them actually take real strides to get to the third round, maybe even the finals? Because these guys are going to be older and they're going to be gone by then. RJ's 22, but like I said, I don't see him becoming a superstar. Obi Toppin, is he going to? I don't think so. Emmanuel Quickly, will he even be there? I don't see it.